Ooh, who's this little bitch? Uh, that's uh. Oh, you guys are. Oh, okay. I, I, well, I didn't know how strong you guys were. Wow. Uh, what? Where did that one? Oh, hey, you can go under the ground. Cool. Okay, you're dead. Ow, that fucking hurt. You are big as fuck. Oh my god, I'm gonna shit my pants. What the fuck? Is, are you coming on me? Oh, 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 not like this. Ow, what the fuck? I got him. Ow, they're throwing cum at me. Oh. I just had a fucking stroke. Where are they at? I'll kill them. Why are they so fucking tanky? Oh my god. Help! Help me! Stop running, you fucking idiot. I'm shooting at you. Excuse me? What? What was that? Whatever. That was a good throw. What the fuck? Alright, listen here, fucking King Kong. I'm about to slap the shit out of you. You understand me, you fucking dumb bitch? Okay, gotta sneak up on him. Easy as cake. Just gotta sneak up on him. One shotgun in the ass. Fucking bitch! Fucking. Ah! You got jumped on! Oh shit! Oh, there's more than one! Oh my god, I'm throwing. Give me. Oh! 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 Oh god! Let me on. Why is there more of you? I'm out. Where's all the loot? I can't abuse the game. Aha! Aha! Oh, that's a big rock. Can't come up here. Haha! Ah! Oh, my legs! Uh, uh. Fuck you, you goddamn apes! I know this fucking trick works, asshole. Uh, I need my crack. Quit. Got him. Easy as pie. Alright, motherfucker. Uh. Eat my dick! Go ambling out in those hills. That's marauder territory, friend. Your pod? What are you on about? You take a bruise through the cranium? Ain't safe out here. You'd best head into town. Avail yourself of Edgewater's high walls and low, low prices. <laughs> hey, I'm Alex Athorton, by the way. I am employed by the Retirement Department of Spacer's Choice. That's fancy talk for working in the cemetery. 
Name's Silas. Junior in humor for the town of Edgewater. We're all part of the Spacer's Choice family. Ah, uh, heard a lot of new workers say that. First time they set eyes on Edgewater, they'll say, well, I can't work here. I don't belong here. Well, we do belong here. The Spacer's Choice family takes care of us from the cradle to the grave. As long as we provide our own cradles. <sighs> okay, man. I'm just looking for a little money while, while I'm here. How can I make it? for being discreet like? There's money to be made, long as you keep your nose clean. I don't st I don't do cocaine. Who's a little fuckhead at? Oh, this is the landing pad. I see. Your landing pad discovered. Hey! Oh god! I've been requisitioning backup. Ugly! Guess the boss finally came to his sense. You ever swung a truncheon? No. Let me see your rifling stance. I want to make sure you're up to snuff. My my what? You okay? I'm talking about mechanical soldier, cold, heartless automatons made of iron and lies. Huh? Are you fucking crazy? Just my luck. I ask for backup, and the boss sends me one of them simple folk. All right. Listen real close. Mm hmm Auto mechanicals. Creatures forged in the fires of malevolence. I seen them over by the old power plant. You think I'm a fucking firing android? Out, firing at the birds. You think I'm a god? Orchestrating their uprising. You think I'm a fucking android? When the swarms of mechanicals come clanging on over that hill, where will you be? Cowering beneath your cot? Or standing? Shoulder to shoulder with the resistance. Probably in my ship, uh, <laughs> leaving this planet. If a resistance, yeah, got them for hire. I've been gathering up a war chest over the years. Saw tuna cans mostly, some spacers chaw, few bit cards. I'll reward you for your aid. Property armies pay in enlistment fees. Yeah, I suppose. Wouldn't want to give the resistance a bad name. Yeah, you wouldn't. You want to give me all your fucking money. Thanks. What do you need done? They have sent a scout. Prowling around the junkyard just behind our beloved town. This scout must not be permitted to return to its base of operations. Cross it off, then report back. Alright, um... Also, uh, pay your fucking fees. I told Silas I'd pay my dues if he agreed to join the resistance. Guess this means he's finally heard the calling. Yep. He sure did, and he's asking for a little extra to, uh, furnish the resistance with mechanical repellent. Mechanical repellent? Yeah. A stroke of inspiration from I the know. law itself. He's a fucking yeah, genius. I've been saving up a couple of bits for just such a project. <laughs> uh, I got a question for you. Go on. What exactly do you do here? I'm Ludwig Miller, Associate Security Officer for Transportation. Officially? Mm -hmm. Unofficially? Strictly between you and me. I am the only thing standing between Edgewater and total annihilation. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, got one more for Go you. On. What do you have against robots? You ever seen the way a mechanical just stands there? Just looking at you. Scanning you with its murderous oculars. You're... Yeah. Ah. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's what they're programmed to do. Those have been programmed to eliminate the human yep. race. They've been programmed to replace us. You're goddamn right, Ludwig. First they will rob us of our jobs. Yep. And once they have taken away our livelihoods... You know it. They will take away our very lives. Mm-hmm. Keep talking. Keep... I gotta go. I got like a... I got like some eggs in the car so i'll <laughs> see you later mister this is a workbench what you got in here oh shit i don't think he noticed whatever yep didn't just steal anything from you man you know me you know me man i'm never a thief 
Oh, birds. I'm sorry. I'll just be a minute. You had a minute. Next one comes out of your pay. Dude. The threats, friend. I'm going. Boss's orders. We all got quotas to make. What the fuck, dude? Let him smoke his cigarette. Oh, what's this? Resident? Who the fucker? Okay. Hey. Yes, what is it? You're an outsider. Fantastic. Vicar Maximilian de Soto at your service. Or Vicar Max if you're the sort who prefers brevity. I, <laughs> I am, I, I didn't mean to skip that. So I'll read it in your voice. So where are you getting you people to talk to me? Name your per poison. Anything at all? Spiritual counseling. The season to smoke prediction is the quickest way to out of this town. <clears throat> um I'm looking for a power regulator, Mr. Man. Mechanical tomfoolery is well out of my purview. I suggest you take such matters to Mr. Thompson in the cannery. Okay. What is he selling? Fuck, I'll buy it. You got me, dude. Alright. I wanted it. What does it look like? Ooh. Thank you for business, good shit, sir. Head? Shit, head, sir. Man? Anyone I can talk to? I don't know you. I'm Ronald A. Duffel. Amelia Kim, Spacer's Choice Beverage Dispenser. I don't know what you're about, but this here is a Spacer's Choice drinking establishment. We're all loyal, hardworking company folk here. I oh, know. Um, something going on here that I should know about? <laughs> what a fine establishment it is. You really think so? <laughs> That's kind of you. I've been trying to keep the doors clean. You got no idea how long it takes to scrub the tiles. Hmm. Guess I missed I'm just trying to get you. those pants off, ma'am. The Hope? No. I've never mixed a drink by that name. I could get you a rum and something if you like. Ah, uh, you think it's a drink? Wait, no. Never mind. We're all out of something. So it's, I'm, I'm from Ho the Hope myself. You feeling a bit flushed? Look, why don't you go set yourself down in the corner before you get all tangle-footed? I'm f tangle footed I'm not drunk. I just don't know if anyone else has made it off the hope. Then pretend you're drunk. Sober folk don't talk the way you are. Not unless they're looking for a trip to Tartarus. What the fuck? Are the you hope's saying? folklore, all right. 60, 70 year old folklore by now. The board don't approve of spreading seditious rumors and false. Bitch, I'm from the hope. You're inviting trouble talking that way. I'm gonna shoot you. And I don't want a part of it. I'm gonna kill you. You sound scared, little bitch. Look. You sound scared. Job or stick a drink in it. We're done talking about this. Oh, you're a little scared. Whatever. Give me a drink. Coming right up. I don't. I don't actually want one. Fuck you, you dumb bitch. I'll fucking put a bullet in your fucking head so fucking fast. Shut the fuck up! Shit bar, I'll never come in this shit fucking place ever again. Where's this dumb shithead at? Oh, the barber shop. Oh, hey! Please don't touch anything. Your hands are probably crawling with germs. Okay. Physical hygiene recapitulates moral hygiene. Cleanliness is next to lawfulness. I can show you my hands. No, thank you. That's I can show you my right. fucking hands. I've seen enough body parts in my line of work. I'm Conrad. You will report to me if your hair fails to meet Spacer's Choice aesthetic standards. You will also report to me in the event of your death. Whereupon I will clean and prepare your remains for interment. Oh, nice. Well, um, I'm looking uh, to repair my ship. A ship? Dear me. You seem to have lost the ability to distinguish between reality and fantasy. This is what happens when you let your imagination run wild. What? I don't approve of fantasizing. It's a dreadful habit, corrosive to the mental faculties. You ought to let the vicar take a look inside your head. No, I'm not. Um, 
I've met him already, and he doesn't want to look in my head. And he allowed you to wander around town spreading your pernicious fantasies about repairing ships? My opinion of him approaches its nadir. Shut the fuck up. You gotta pay your fucking dues. Ah, gravesite fees. Silas and I had talked about this at length. I thought I'd made it clear my pecuniary situation precludes the necessary restitutions. I'm gonna put a bullet in your head as well. I don't understand where you mean you're broke. As broke as pie crust, friend. Bitless, indigent, destitute. I simply cannot afford it. I am a blemish on the prosperity of our fair settlement. When I expire, I expect Silas to toss my body into a ditch. I hope so. I don't care. Pay up. With what? My own blood? Tell Silas I can't afford to pay. And that I fully expect to have my medical rights revoked for this dereliction. With my apologies. Fuck you. Oh, God.